Welcome to me hitting the table with my chair. 30 inks, 30 days, day 24. Wait, I feel like I say that a little bit like Manda. Manda, I love you. Um, today is the feast day edition of 30 inks. Mm-hmm. Hey, look. Uh, yesterday, oh, in case you saw my hiking video, yes, I made it safe, home safe and sound. Thanks for those of you that voiced concern. Uh, yesterday we had Brandy Snap, a 20, I feel like I'm talking really loud, a 2021 Ink Man Ink. Here is the dried splat. The chromatography is like a little bit of brown at the top, then yellow, then an orangey, then a red, and gray. Um, I don't know. Uh, it was a very well behaved ink. And I don't like the color. If you like the color, hey, it's a great ink. Now for today, our rando numbo generator has given us ooh, an ink. Let us find this. All right. Those of you who are observant will note today's ink is Sailor Yurimaku Kyokuya. Um, I'm just updating my little spot shirt that does the stuff. Um, am I thrilled about this? Sure. Why not? Why the heck not? Let's find a pen for this butte. I'm running out of pens. I don't want to put this butte in. Or maybe I never had any to begin with. <clears throat> Sorry. I'm a little silly. Mm. Is it safe? So I hesitate to put inks in this pen that I don't know if they're safe. But given that I'm writing with this for one day, I'll take the risk. Because I think that's a good match. I keep thinking I'm going to sell this pen. And I should... But then I keep using it and thinking, oh, but it's so pretty. Oh, you know what? We might have a practical difficulty. Well, we'll see if we can fill. If we can't fill from this, then we have to pick a different pen. Because this has to, I can't syringe fill this. Um, so the ink again is Sailor Yurimeku Kyokuya, which was Ink Flight from August, according to my card. Which, by the way, if you've watched my Ink Flight things, I put that on afterwards. I don't put that on in the video. Because. Because I said so, that's why. Um, I have actually done chromatography for all of these Yurimeku inks. But they're upstairs, and that's a world away, okay? Did I say that today's the 24th? Look, you know what day it is. And maybe it's not the 24th when you're watching this. So get over yourself, Maria. I don't know if this inked. I did the things that should make it have ink in it. But I'll tell you one thing that 38 inks kind of convinces me of. Filling fountain pens may involve some kind of ritual that I am not yet privy to. Maria, wow, you're just going to leave that open right there, huh? Okay. That seems safe, huh, girl? Mm -hmm. 
Um, I'll have you know, if you watched my epic hike video, I did carry a fountain pen with me. Oh yeah, that's a juicy one. Look at that. Um, I carried, it was um, this one. My toys we go. And despite all the jostling, it did pretty well. So that was impressive. Oh, hi. Oh, did you go too far in the, yeah, you're fine. Okay, we're off to the races. Do, 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 do. So today is thirty inks, thirty days. November twenty twenty two. Day twenty four. Should we like the hand turkey? And it usually has a pilgrim hat on it for some reason. I feel bad about what I've just done. For so many reasons. Pilgrim my help. You're my who? Ooh, yeah. Okay, it needs to come out of the water. Yeah, check it. Check it, friends. Look at that chromatography. It's a blue at the bottom. More of a, it's definitely a cool blue, almost a blurpily, blurpily blue. That's hard to say. With pink. And then a yellow, like a golden buttery yellow, and then above it is a lime. And actually between the yellow and the pink right now, there is this green in there, an emerald. At the top we've got that lime and then a hint of aqua. Who knows how it'll dry? Boop, boop, boop. Okay, now we go on to pen. Pen, Maria? Look, we did it, it happened, we're leaving it. I've been sewing today. I'll blame that. Can we read this? Look, it's ever sharp. Doric? Flex. So gorgeous. You have to be careful to not flex this pin. If you've never used a vintage pin with flex, you probably cannot understand what that writing experience is like. It's so different. Any modern flex I've used has been drastically different. The closest would be um, a pointed pin calligraphy nib, but that is more stabby in the non-flex, like, look, it's time to splat, okay? We're gonna say, relax, and splat, get to it. Okay, so we remember now that when we do the splat, the thing goes So we gotta weigh this down. That's me learning. No, that's me applying my not learning. Maria, what are you doing? Turn the paper. Turn around. Bright ink. Every now and then I splat apart. Okay, I'm fired. Um, I blame the lack of pie. Oh gosh. 
kind of looks like a hippopotamus, but not when I have it this way. Now it kind of looks a little bit like a walrus on a skateboard. I'm glad you can't see the face I just made it myself for even thinking that foolishness. So uh, here we are. <laughs> you know what, day 24 in our vintage pen. Look it. I tried. I blocked off. I did what I could. You know what? That's all you can do. You can just try. And then apply your knowledge and try better next time. I suppose this is life lessons a la 30 inks 30 days. Ask me about my hike sometime, hey? Talk about trying and doing better next time. Um... If you're watching this video when it goes up, hi, I hope you're having a good day. Um, I feel awkward about Thanksgiving because like it's predicated on a lie, but I like, an, I, I like a day where we give thanks for what we have. So I would like to give thanks to all of you for choosing to spend your time with me, for choosing to interact with me and leave me wonderful comments and and say nice things and say critical things that help me get better as a YouTuber. Though I got to admit, I kind of do what I want, um, but I still like hearing feedback. Um, so thank you all for being a part of my life. Um, and... On that note, cheers, friends. Boop. I hope you have a wonderful day whenever you're watching this, and I hope that you also have something that you can be thankful for. Bye.